Question 16. Mail routing. Answer. A server-based task that allows users to exchange mail via a LAN, WAN, gateways. Question 17. Difference between replica and new copy. Answer. New replica have same replica ID. New copy will not the same. Question 18. Transactional logging. Answer. Transaction logging captures all the changes made to a database and writes them to a transaction log. Transactions are reordered sequentially in the log files, which is much quicker than database updates to random. Question 19. Difference between refresh design and replace. Answer. Refresh. Refresh page contain up-to-date information replace. Change the existing one to new one. Question 20. Compact tasks and type. Answer. Types. In place compacting with space recovery. In place compacting with space recovery and reduction in file size copy style compacting. Question 21. Difference abdol and update. Answer. Update. Update is loaded at server by default and runs continually. It will update view index. Abdol. Abdol doesn't continually or work from queue. Run abdol when it is needed. It will update view index. Question 22. Can external LDAP directory be used in Domino? Answer. No. Question 23. What is directory assistance? Answer. Directory assistance. Directory assistance is a feature a server can use to look up information in a directory other than a local primary Domino directory, names, NSF. Question 24. Where can I see the recertify id notification period, and how can I change this? Answer. A go into the Domino Administrator, and to the Configuration tab, and then choose Certification on the right hand side. Choose ID Properties, select the ID file, enter the password, and then it will display the expiration date. To recertify, choose Certify, then you must choose the Certifier id file. Usually, Certifier id enters its password, then choose the ID file file you wish to recertify after that enter its password amend the expiration date and hit certify question 25 when a user logs into lotus notes web browser it opens with the following error done but with errors on page he cannot see his mail when he tries it on another machine it works this tells me that it has something to do with the settings on the machine what could it be answer a if possible try another browser from the same machine e.g firefox you should take note that ie often creates strange things due to security settings since you have one working and the other doesn't try to compare Compare the two sets of settings. I recommend Firefox if possible for this use. It is compatible with Inotes 5 and 6 or default mailboxes. Question 26. I have a user that uses both a laptop and desktop computer. He was able to replicate just fine but encountered a weird issue. The user reads a message on the desktop and then switches back to laptop and does a replication on it. The problem is that the message he just read on the desktop was still marked unread on the laptop even though he just read it on the desktop and did a replication. Is it possible to have the messages read on either the desktop or laptop to be marked as read on the other computer? After after he completes a replication, answer, a you can add, replicator underscore unread underscore sync equals minus one to take notes, any, file. You can set it in the database preferences as well with take, replicate unread marks to all servers. Question 27. I have a user who is getting doc links to the notes in DB, but the doc link doesn't come through. It is replaced by the following document link D flat name view. I have replaced her mail template, but it's still not working. Other users are getting the doc link just fine. What am I missing? Answer. A check the field format preference for incoming mail in the main directory first. It will probably work best with the setting keep in sender format unless there are some strange routings via SMTP or others that might change the original format. Question 28. I have a user that is receiving emails in the inbox, which are already red or black. I tried replace design, upgrade folder design, and check to make sure that the flag mark documents read when opened in preview pane was not checked. We are using SIG 5.2 version. What can be the solution to this? Answer. A from the workspace. Right click the mouse on the database and select database, then properties. Under the fourth tab, make sure the do not mark modified documents as unread is checked under the seventh tab make sure they don't maintain unread marks is not checked 
Question 29. We are migrating to Exchange and include several users with local archives on their mailboxes. Most of these users need the archives, but I can't seem to figure out a way of doing it at all. Is there a way of doing this or an application someone else has used that work? Is there any way of migrating archive? Answer. A the Exchange Migration Wizard, free with Exchange, can read the mail in archive and create a PST file. It was done as a test one time by putting the archive on the server and then changing the person doc that was the user's mail file. This was done on a test system that wasn't running the live mail. Question 30. I have a user that tried to delete an email. She got a type mismatch error. The email then gets an X next to it and if she refreshes the screen, it's deleted. Why did she receive the error message? Answer. A. It seems like a typical refresh design issue. In the mailbox, go to file, database, design, refresh design and choose the mail server, then validate. If that does not solve the issue, repeat the manipulation but choose replace design instead. Choose the mail server and the proper mail template and then validate you can also do it in another way go to tools preferences calendar and to do and then to auto process the automatic inbox management will be blank choose an option in there again and it will work fine